So, uh, welcome back YouTube, uh, welcome to AIDS DIY Builds. Uh, today we're going to look at some sort of ventilation system for the tiny workshop. Uh, when you're welding in here, um, I have to keep the doors closed because the dogs like to see the welding, not good. It gets quite smoky. Uh, I know you can't see this, but there are up on the apex some little vents, but they don't really seem to work. Um, they just kind of hold a bit of heat. So what we're going to do is I have uh, a vent for a tumble dryer. Uh, I'm going to cut, you can't see this also, uh, up here in the apex, I'm going to cut a circle. I'm going to keep this on, cut that, attach that from the outside, screw it in. Uh, we do, I got some old PC fans. I actually rigged this one up just to see, because this actually, if I cut the tabs off, this would have fit in the vent absolutely perfectly. Um, so I've just rigged this up very quickly to um, test. It doesn't draw enough air on its own. It ba barely even moves these, so that's definitely not going to um, give any airflow. Uh, I have another two. So I, what we're going to do is pull this off of here. Probably going to have this one in the center. And just draw a bit there. I'm gonna build something like that. That's uh, gonna hover just over on this side. Got some steel here somewhere. I'm gonna build some sort of bracing. Um, I'm just gonna attach all that into a funnel. So it should then funnel a lot more air. Make these move. Suck all the smoke and uh, smoke out. And on a day like today, we don't get it too often here in Wales, but a day like today, it's really warm. The thermometer, not sure if you can see that. Uh, it's still, it's in the morning. It's uh, creeping up to about 24 degrees inside. Um, so come mid afternoon, three o'clock-ish, it gets really hot in here. Um, so hopefully it's gonna vent some of that heat out or just have a bit of airflow more than anything. So I'm gonna, do a bit of a close-up on these. A lot of people will ask, how do you know which ones on, especially on the black ones? How do you know which three wires connect to red and black? Actually, I was gonna research it, but when I found these fans, you got these ones here with the three tab. And this one also has a three tab. So I was lucky to see which ones are which, black on the outside, red, yellow. So yeah, um, the one that we're not using, I believe that is, um, uh, that's for, uh, it's a sensor for um, when it hits a certain degree, it will really ramp up the fan. Um, this is a case fan. Likewise, these two are front facing case fans. So. What I might do quickly is just rig these up, uh, see how much kind of air they are pushing pushing out. This is quite short. This was from another project I had. So, true aid style, I'm just gonna splice this wire, attach it, some tape, and let's get going. I'm not too worried about soldering this. It's still 12 volts, uh, I think this was two amps. So if it's not taped perfectly, I'm not really bothered. I'm gonna give you a tiny shock, no more than licking a, a light switch. And the reason I didn't just use this one is this is five volt. 0.5 amps. I don't even know what that powered. Probably a telephone system, I imagine.
Okay. So on these um, these little plugs, you will notice that the both wires are black, and likewise for these three. But you will see that there's white on the back. The dash dot system. That is normally your black feed. Always double check them. Um, I know we're just using this as a bit of extension wire, but we do have the same on here. It might be hard to see. So I'm going to keep it the same. Um, firstly, actually, firstly, I'm going to splice these. This one's going to be a bit easier, so I'm just, I'm just going to cut the, the Molexes off those. Actually, separate them. One thing to note when you're uh, doing fans, uh, <coughs> here we have 12 volt and 2 amps. You do have to do a bit of math. Um, this was 12 volt, volt at 0.25 amps, so I know I could run quite a few of these actually off of that. I would say you go um, amp for amp, you could technically run 8 some fans require just a little bit extra just to get them going and they stabilize that at their um, face ambage so if i was going to run loads of these probably up for that run maybe six at a push seven i definitely wouldn't use um, the full ambage Okay, this works. Not a great load of airflow there. It's about LEDs too. There you go. That one. That one. Like singly, not too good. Together, that's definitely going to push a bit of air. And then, black one. Black one actually probably pushes a bit more air. So, so on its own. That way. Probably see it just about moving these. No. It's not great. I wonder. So building a whole rig. We one over another over another. How does that work? Oop. I need some spacers, can you do that? That's my fingers. Just as a test, hang on. Make this a bit easier. Let's turn that off. Use a tiny cap. Oh, a tiny cap. Just bring these together. Oi! <laughs> 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 
tab's not working. Let's try it on as a bench test. Definitely better. How much is it going to draw out? I don't know. Probably the dogs. But definitely pushing a lot more than if it was on its own. See what it's like on the other side. <laughs> okay, well, it looks like it's working, so, um, Mm, testing. Okay, well it seems to be pulling up, pulling up when I'm up here. It's hard to tell, or you guys can't see because I've light. Um, I weld mainly here, so that'll go up and hopefully just go 
out. Um, I'll leave that on for now. I'm going to go put the tabs back on. And I'll just show you that working on the other side. <coughs> so, uh, I've got a bit of the cable management to do because, you know, it's not great. Um, but that, that's basically a very inexpensive uh, vent system. It's yet to be trialled out. Um, and I, might, I may get a little, uh, knock up a little uh, welding uh, video later on. Really just get a lot of smoke. I think I've got some 6013 um, rods, which with a lot of flux on there, that will really create some smoke. We'll just test it out. Uh, so thanks for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment if you have any tips or hints. I uh, really appreciate it. Um, oh, lastly, the total bit, um, cost for this build so far was the, the only thing I had to get was the vent. Um, that cost I think about four seventy, something like that, um, on Amazon. That was it. It was a six uh, five inch vent. Uh, the fans I already had. Everything else I already had. Uh, that was it. So if it works, even partly for now, yeah, great. Uh, if not, I, do you know what? I think I'd, I'd, I'd just get some um, extra fans or better fans. So I think these are quiet computer ones, which the quiet ones to me, and I could be wrong, they just don't suck out, uh, or have a lot of airflow. That's why you have a lot of fans in there. But it seems to work for now. I can actually feel the air pulling past my hand here, which is good. We shall see. I'll go put these up, I'll show that working. Um, thanks.